Brick Addicts, Lego lovers, friends from all over the world. Today, we got a real special treat for you. We're gonna go inside the Lego store. One of the coolest sets we've ever done, and it's had another upgrade. So we figured we'd bring you the upgrade. And since myself or none of our good friends are available today, this ball-headed fireman, he is going to be our tour guide today. So here we go. Let's start by briefly showing the roof. It's got all kinds of vents, all kinds of electric, all kinds of HVAC, stuff like that. Got a nice big HVAC system over there, which we try to be different with all of our HVAC systems. Got some piping, plumbing stuff, conduit, all that good stuff. Let's pull the roof off if I don't completely destroy it. All right, fireman fell. Let's take a look here. It is the fireman contemplates where to go next. I wonder, how are you guys and girls doing? Has everyone had a good summer? Be sure to comment below. You know, we care about each and every one of you and we love all of you. We just want to uh, hear how everyone's summer is going. For those of you returning to school, I hope you have a great year. And uh, hopefully it's uh, not too hard, not too much work. So of course, sometimes work is a good thing. This fireman is ready. He is ready. He knows what Lego sets he's gonna get. He's excited. So we're going to show you the front first. We added a whole bunch of stickers to the front. Also shifted a couple around. Now the only bad thing about having the stickers is you can't quite see the displays, the penguin and the airplane. But you know what? When they run specials and stuff, they uh, have to display them, right? So you can see the uh, yellow car, which sometimes is red. In this case, it's yellow. Farmer sticker with the pig there. All right, this guy's eager. He wants to get in here and do some shopping. So let's go inside. Now inside we have also added some things, moved some things around. You know, typical brick attic fashion. We try to keep it interesting. So he first walks in and he sees two of the coolest Lego sets in the world. The Grand Emporium and the restaurant. Can't remember the name right off the top of my head. It says my mind. A bunch of classic sets there in the middle. I don't think he's going to get any of these today. He might get those. On the flip side of that, you got the detective's office and town square or assembly square. Assembly square, that's it. He might even end up leaving with those as well. Let's check out the displays from the back, of course. So you've got an airplane and a penguin. Sweet. There's the penguin. Airplane, of course, the airplane's got a pretty cool stand it goes on. Be sure to check out the assembly video of this set. <laughs> it's about an hour long and was not easy to make. But it shows how to build all this stuff. There's the yellow car, which in the assembly video is red. So we changed that up a little bit. Looks like I need to do some fixing here of the shelf. There's a blue car sitting in there. The Millennium Falcon. Very cool little set on display. And a whole bunch of print sets. So we added a whole ton of stickers to the walls. Got a uh, police officer running with handcuffs. Probably his buddy chasing somebody. We got a guy holding a what looks like Nintendo controller. Got a spaceman on the back. Got them a couple times. Got a guy over here behind a Lego block. Okay, the back wall, which happens to be my favorite wall in this set. You've got a little bit of everything on this one. You've got Jurassic Park sets. Just feast your eyes on that. You've got several city sets and some of my favorite. I like that police truck down there in the middle. And over here, you got the uh, creator on top. The boat, the house. 
Oh, there we go. Now we're talking technique. Technique sets. Those two right there, the yellow and the uh, black truck. Absolutely awesome. Love those. All right, now we cannot skip this. Everyone, one of the coolest Lego sets ever made, the Star Wars sets. Very popular and with good reason. So I see Millennium Falcon in there. I see all kinds of stuff. So the Star Wars sets are of course on main display. Now, usually depending on what we're filming, because this is a set that we oftentimes use to put ourselves in it. There's a lot of videos that has me sitting at this desk, for example. And so sometimes we will move these boxes and face them this direction. But I figured for this video, I'd start at this angle and show them like that. But nevertheless, Star Wars, you got your kids play area right here where they can build and do cool stuff. I think we might add some stickers to that. And of course, the, you know what, we'll save the checkout for a last because that's where he is gonna go to buy his purchases. Okay, the pick a brick wall. That is probably my second favorite part of this set and probably my most favorite part of a Lego store. The pick a brick wall. So you've got the different sections of the Legos just stick your hand in there and grab them and right here are the lids and the cups you just pop them right off the wall and there you go fill them up and you are all set some information about the uh, sets stuff like that we try to model these sets off of actual stores or whatever we're building for example the Walmart is pretty much modeled for the most part, somewhat, I guess you could say, after a real Walmart. Minus the red box <laughs> wanting to fall down. But like with the uh, cereal and stuff like that. So, so we try to take all that into consideration when we do these. And we almost went two stories on this one, but decided not to. So, lots of stickers. Stickers are fun. So, you got the pick a brick wall, you got the play area, you've got <clears throat> some of the coolest, the absolute coolest Lego sets ever right there. The Grand Emporium is probably my favorite. Of course, it's probably one of the biggest in the back. So let's take one more peek at the whole thing. Swoop in and Mr. Fireman Mr. Fireman will go to the counter and he will make his purchases. I'm not sure where the Lego employee's at. He's probably in the back or in the bathroom or something, but when he comes out, the fireman just has to swipe his card and he's all set. This must be the uh, mystery box right here. So, got a Lego store cash register display right there. And you know what? I know he's wanting these, the Texas Detectives Office and uh, Assembly Square. I know he wants those. He told me that himself. So he's probably going to have somebody help him load those up. Nevertheless, everyone, friends, fellow Lego lovers, we do appreciate you watching today. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. If you like the video, please smash that like button down below without breaking your device, of course. Tell everyone, please share. Share with your hamster, your aunts, your uncles, your dogs, your cats, if they're capable of using a device. If you like detailed, highly detailed Lego sets, click right there. If you like vlogs and behind the scenes stuff, click right there. We take you behind the scenes and show you everything. We'll see you all in the next video.